Hey you guys, so I'm here with another haul, same scenery, same outfit, this is the same day, I'm filming two hauls in one day because I wanted to get this over with, but this is more of a kind of makeup, clothing, thrift store, drug store, Marshalls, yeah, all that kind of haul, so I hope you guys enjoy it, I'm just going to kind of jump into it. The first thing I want to show you are um, the things I picked up from Marshalls, so I picked up these Chinese laundry, just black little... Um, heels. It's kind of like a two inch, two and a half inch heel, and it looks like this. And I got these at Marshalls, and I got them on sale for twenty dollars. If you can see right there, I wanted to keep the price on it. They were originally sixty dollars, and I got them at Marshalls for twenty. These are a size six and a half, and they are a perfect little heel for kind of like business casual. And then the next shoes, I think you guys will love, love, love because I love them, and they are the Steve Madden. Um, pumps that I picked up and they are the glittery multicolored pump this is like a five four and a half five inch heel and I absolutely adore this I've been wanting to pick these up for so long just because they're just multicolored and they would probably go with anything that I would be wearing so I absolutely love these I love five inch heels I'm really short I'm five one so anything with the heel is amazing and Steve Madden and I got these at Marshalls for you won't even believe how much $25. They were clearance and they were my size, size six and a half. And I was so excited because these originally I was going to pay like a hundred for them or like 90. I forget how much they are, but I'm so excited. I got them for $25. So if you guys don't know what a Marshalls is, it's kind of like a TJ Maxx or just kind of like a discounted store. Um, but they have really good designer products there. And you, if you're lucky, you can find really good deals. But I got this kind of just plain black button up and it has a little detail in the front. This is kind of just for my business class. I paid $16.99 for it. And then I got this right here which is just a black throw over. It's short sleeve and just kind of a throw over and I got this on the clearance rack for $2. So I was like okay I can't pass this up. I can probably work with it and do something with it. Add a belt to it or something like that and then kind of cinch it up. So I thought that was awesome for 2 bucks. Like you couldn't beat that. And then I got this top right here, which is kind of like a business casual top for me. I can wear this with like dress pants or something like that. And it looks like this. I love the neckline, the detail of it. And I love the color. It's kind of like a nude, taupey color. It was on sale for only five bucks. Like, can't beat that. You can't. This is kind of just a random tank top. It's gray and it has this neckline with gold sequins. And it's a racer back and it just kind of flows. So got that also so now I'm gonna show you things that I got from my local thrift store and if you guys aren't really into thrifting because for some reason I don't know some people don't like the idea of thrifting it's used clothes but you know take it to the cleaners or wash it a few times you know it's not a big deal to me personally I found this really adorable purple kind of like blouse that has flowy arms and this little necktie thing I have to figure that out but I got this for a dollar at my thrift store so that's really cute it fits me really well so I got that and then also at my local thrift store I found dress pants and like business casual skirts so I could wear to my interviews and um, meetings and stuff like that so this is the first one it's just brown has two buttons and it's just I don't know it's just a brown pencil skirt I got this for a dollar also so and the brand it's pretty good it is international concepts which they sell this at Macy's so this brands at Macy's and I got it for a dollar at my thrift store I mean you know that's a good deal and then I also got two pairs of dress pants and if you work in like a professional type career or anything you guys know dress pants are really expensive Jones New York and this is the first dress pant. This is just a brown color. And I don't know, they're just kind of, I don't know, they're just dress pants. And these are high-waisted, so they're a little more fashionable, I guess you could say. So I got these. This was only $3. And I got the same pair in, like, a green color. So I got two of these. They were $3 each. So I'm just like, okay, Jones New York dress pants for $3 each. That is this bargain, and I couldn't pass that up, so I got those. And then I also got two blazers at the thrift store, and I'm really into blazers. So this is the first one I got, and the brand is Evan Pacone. I don't know, but it's a size 4. It's a little bigger on me. It's more of like a boyfriend blazer, I would say, but it is navy blue, really good structure, has small shoulder pads, and pretty long. It's just casual, and this was only a dollar. I just need to 
take this to the cleaner still. That's why I have them in like a bag. But this one also is from Jones, New York. And this is the same brand as the dress pants I just showed you. And this was also a dollar. So I absolutely love it. It's again a navy blue color, but I love the gold button detail. So I think that makes it really great. This is shorter, so it's more of like a crop jacket. And this was only a dollar also at my thrift store. You can find some great things at thrift stores. So I really recommend you guys go to a thrift store, try it out. It's not for everybody. My, a lot of my friends think I'm weird for shopping at thrift stores, but you can find some really awesome things. And the last thing I'm going to show you guys um, clothing wise is this jacket that I found at the thrift store I went crazy I even tweeted it when I found this it's the craziest bit find I've ever found so it is a jacket and it's by the brand Moschino and if you guys know if you guys are like fashionistas you guys know this brand and it's the cheap and chic line of Moschino Moschino has like different lines I believe and it's made in Italy and when I googled it, Chino CNC jackets go from like $700 to $2,000. So this is the jacket that I got. And it has sequins um, on the collar. Then it has sequins around the waist. And then it has sequins on the, um, what's it called, wrists or cuffs or whatever. And then it goes super long. Like it hits me. This is a perfect trench coat for me because it's long but it's just perfect it looks so classy on I still need to take it to the cleaner but I absolutely love this and I paid 99 cents for this Moschino CNC jacket when originally Moschino CNC jackets go for thousands of dollars you guys can really find good treasures at the thrift store I was so excited and I want to share it with you guys because you guys can probably go to your thrift stores and you never know what you can find that's what I love about thrift stores and that's why I think a lot of people like about thrift stores is because you never know what you're gonna find I found like a thousand dollar jacket for 99 cents who does that <laughs> so now I'm gonna move on to more of the makeup I went to CVS over the weekend I've got a whole bunch of Milani cosmetics for so inexpensive. If you follow me on Twitter or Facebook, I tweet and I update my Facebook with the deals that I find, especially in the drugstores. And when I find it, I update right away because I want you guys to go out and get that same deal that I got. So when I updated my Facebook about this, a lot of you guys were like really excited. I do a little thing called deal alerts. So if you like my deal alerts, thumbs up. But anyway, so if you want to follow me on Facebook or Twitter, the links will be all down below. But I got a whole bunch of Milani products for so, so inexpensive. I wish I had the receipt. These two are Milani mineral, I guess just mineral powders. They're just pressed powders. And I got two of them. This one is in true beige. And this one is lighter. And this one's in nude buff. And I got these for $2.19. 75% off. So I got those. And then I got these three concealers, which are the HD Advanced Concealers, and they're the Click Ones. I hope you can read that. But yeah, they're the Click Ones. I was going to buy this full price just a few months ago, and I'm so excited that I waited and I didn't get them till now because I got them for $2.35 when they were originally around $10 some, or 10 something. But yeah. $2.35 each. I got two of the mediums and then 04 is medium honey. These eyeliners I got for $1.25 each. They are just black eyeliners and I figured you can never really mess up a black eyeliner because when I wear black eyeliner, I actually swatch these already and it's very pigmented so I put them on my waterline or my lash line and then I smudge it out and set it with the eyeshadow anyway so they don't move. So got two of these. These are pencil ones so you have to sharpen it but they're $1.25 and I wanted to try them out. Three nail polishes and these came out to $1.19 each. So the first one I got is the Milani Black Magic nail polish and it's just honestly a black color. I don't have a black nail polish so I figured this would be great. I wouldn't probably not wear this alone. Well sometimes I would wear black nail polish but probably something over it. So I love this for $1.19. Couldn't beat that. And then I got this one in Gold Dust. And this is just a beautiful gold color. I thought this would be nice for spring. And it's just $1.19. Again, I couldn't pass it up. I'm horrible. When there's a sale, I just want to buy everything. But this one is probably my favorite nail polish. And this one's called Midnight Satin. 
and it's a beautiful blackened blue color. Got one eyeshadow, and this was um a dollar eighty-two when it was originally like seven dollars, eight dollars, something like that. So this one's called Coffee Shop. And this was probably my favorite out of all the ones that were on sale. Not everything is on sale, just select items. And it's at CVS if you're wondering. I mean, I don't know if it's still going on if you're, if, or if your uh, CVS will still have all these products. But look how beautiful this color is. It's amazing. And it's so smooth. One swipe. Beautiful brown burgundy color. And this is a color I could probably wear on a daily. That's why I got it. They have other colors like a green color and stuff. But I wouldn't wear that on the, a daily. So I love this. Great deal for a dollar something. Couldn't pass that up. Of course, blushes. Whoop, as I almost dropped them. They are the Milani Mineral Blushes. Turn them all around. Looks like that. And these were a dollar eighty-two each. And they are amazing. So this first one is called Sunset Beach. Swatch it for you. Look at the pigmentation. That's amazing. So that's right there. Next one here is called My Tie. And this one is beautiful. Look how bright that is. So this one's My Tie. And that is right there. So that's amazing. These are so pigmented. For $1.82, I couldn't pass it up. This one here is called Luminous. And looks like this. So this one is more of a sparkle. All of them are matte besides this one. And this one more has a more of a sheen to it. Like a light peachy. I don't even know if you can see that. I hope you can see that. This is really beautiful. And then the last one is Summer or Sweet Rose. Sweet Rose. And it looks like this. Beautiful kind of more of a plummy mauve color. And that's right there. So love it. They're so pretty. And if you're wondering, um, there is a mirror on the bottom and a brush that comes with it. Also went to Rite Aid and I picked up two of my liquid liners. It's by, uh, it's by Maybelline and it's the line stiletto. I like the L'Oreal one too. Anything with a felt tip is great. So I got two of these because they were buy one get one half off. So I got those. And then I also got these which I don't know if you guys know about. I'm definitely going to do a separate review. Okay I'm sorry for all the noise outside. I live in the city and you just hear a whole bunch of crazy noises outside. But anyway Rite Aid has their own line of brushes. Hello! So, it's called the Rite Aid Renewal Brushes. So that's what it looks like if you want to go look for them at your Rite Aid. But they are amazing. Surprisingly. So, they look like this. I got four of them. Two eye brushes. One's an eyeshadow brush, one's a smudge brush, and then the two face brushes. This one is an angled blush brush, and this one is a powder brush. I took this powder one out. Actually, let me take it out for you. It is so soft. Like, amazingly soft. So this is what it looks like. It's pretty big, and it's so soft. They are synthetic hairs, I believe. Um, I haven't washed them or anything yet, so i got to do that before I test them out. But they're so soft. It's amazing. So I'm definitely going to do a separate video on these. The face brushes were $7.99 each, and then the eye brushes were $3.99. So that's a really good deal. If you guys are interested, go check out your Rite Aid. I know not all Rite Aids carry the brush line, but I think a lot of them do. So if you are curious about those, go check them out. Or if you want a video on them, let me know. I think I want to do a video on them anyway, but let me know um, if you guys really, really want a video because then I'll put a step on that. If you have any requests with anything that you saw in my haul video, then just let me know down below. And thank you for liking, thank you for subscribing, commenting. You guys are really supportive and I can't thank you guys enough for being there for me and you guys just inspire me to make more videos so i hope i will see you guys soon and talk to you later bye oh, look,